with each beam. You know Same saying. old dream. Oh, yeah, I like it there. You like it there? Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. And every stop that we make, I can go, oh, I fall about you. Oh, yeah. It gives me room there. Oh, yeah. But when I pull down the shade, then I really fell blue. I peeked through the cracks and looked at the track. The one going back to you And what did I do? I thought about you I told him I wanted to do a, a concert with Joyce and he said okay and then uh, I, I wanted to do a quartet concert and I wanted Renardo Ward on drums, and I wanted Jonathan Wires on bass, so I was able to hire everybody, and we got the date, and we did the concert, and it was fantastic. And I thought to myself, my God, Joyce Cobbs, she's like one of the great singers in the world. And I, and I wanted to record Joyce really singing these jazz standards, because I think that she's a master. You know, she reminds me of a cross between uh, Billie Holiday and, and and, and Ella Fitzgerald. Sometimes I hear Billy, sometimes I hear Ella, you know. But, in, but within all that, I hear Joyce, you know. There's, there's something very pure about her, her musicality. The night is getting on, the band is getting slow, the crowd is almost gone, and here we are dancing. Nothing to do but walls. Our feet can hardly move, legs are yelling woo We're in such a groove, love is advancing Nothing to do but walls. You can't suggest that we can go on jitterbugging Basically, I, I became attracted to music, singing in the girls' choir at my uh, grade school and high school. It was the headquarters for the archbishop. So we, as a girls' choir, had to learn all the pontifical high masses and the liturgies. We had to sing mass every day. The Catholic music was pretty rigid. It's like sitting down playing Mozart and Bach. You better play it just like they wrote it. I fell in love with jazz at home. I was listening to Ella's. And I was listening, I fell in love with horn lines of Charlie Parker, my favorite, or piano lines of Theolonius Monk. And they, they just stuck to me. And I came out of college knowing that stuff. I knew it. I just knew it because I grew up with it. And I knew the melodies. But the Catholic Church gave me discipline and the importance of, of singing it exactly like it's written. And performing uh, on the level of, of uh, you know, holidays like Christmas. And, and, and listen, we used to pray every day. I hate to say it, but we used to pray every day that someone would pass on so that we could get out of class and sing the Requiem Masses. Requiem eternam, Dominus Dominus Do you know Michael Jeffries allowed me to pick, to select all of them? These are songs I've been familiar with, just teaching. And they're always songs that I've always wanted to do. And sometimes it's hard to get band groups uh, on a local level to really get serious into getting these songs down because they have nowhere to really sing them, you know, sing these kind of, like Monk and Parker. I think we have uh, Fats Waller. Uh, these are the composers on this project. Um, and you, when, you're, when you're booked in the city, you have, they want to hear Motown and Stax and rock and roll and blues and maybe the songbook of Gershwin, you know, I, I get to do that, Gershwin and, and Duke Ellington and those, uh, Jerome Kern and Hoagy Carmichael's, those are always, those will never go away. And my dad told me years ago, he says, you learn the pop book and you'll always work. I'm more of a, of a 
mature a company is than I am of anything else, really. And I've worked with a lot of singers, and uh, and I like to do it because I because I like to. I just like to play with with musicians, you know. And I always just like to, to. It's like a dance, you know, and you dance with them. And, and when you when you play with a singer, you know, it's a more is a way it's a more intimate dance because you got to be real clear, you know, so that they always know that you know where they are. So come, let the walls be.